That's a little too fast, I'm not gonna lie to you. To slap someone? Bro, put knives on that sh Hello? Yo, Nick, is it cool if I slap you? What? I have an idea for a video, but it involves you getting slapped. Are you in? I mean, do you think it's gonna get views? Maybe. Okay, yeah, yeah, let's do it. Here's my alarm clock, Amazon Alexa. Fuck this thing. But at the end of the day, they're both trash because audio alone isn't enough to wake you up. It's actually why the dinosaurs went extinct. They slept through the meteorites, that's facts. What if instead of just making noises, the alarm clock was set to just start slapping you at a certain time? Thanks to our trusty volunteer, we're gonna find out how that turns out. Kid says he needs help carrying stuff in. Oh, what's up, bro? I have three thousand dollar worth of shit checked in right now. Some fake hands, an Arduino Uno, a relay, and a twelve volt motor, which claims to be high torque. But I guess we'll be the judge of that. <laughs> All right, guys, it's my friend's birthday right now, so we're gonna wish him a happy birthday. I just got on a call with him. Hey, Siraj. Hey. Happy birthday, dude. Oh, thanks so much. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Nick, that's pretty creepy. There's a thunderstorm outside. All right, well now introducing a new segment called Okay, but how the fuck is it gonna work though? Please respond. I'm nine years old. Or ah, oh, for short. Well, it starts with this thing right here, the motor. This is like the boss. Similar to how you don't bite the hand that feeds you, this is gonna spin the hand that slaps you. And if that didn't make sense, you're probably unemployed. Since this is a 12 volt motor, I need a 12 volt power supply. So to turn the motor on, you can basically just connect the leads. Holy fuck, that scared the shit out of me. Yeah, this is a horrible fucking idea to do that. Now, the problem here is we don't want it to always be spinning. We only want it to spin when our alarm clock goes off. And that's where this big bad boy relay comes in. Now, I like to pretend that a relay is like the doorman at a frat party. Like the electricity is trying to come through and the relay is just standing outside asking, who do you even know here? And then the relay would go to its frat brothers and be like, hmm, should we let these guys in? And if the frat brothers, the Arduino, sends the signal, then it would let that shit through. But that's not how it actually works. In reality, it's more like, imagine a wire that has a cut in the middle, so it's not actually connected. And the relay, if it has a signal, it would just give it that connection, like a switch. But how is it actually gonna keep track of time? Like, am I gonna attach it to a real clock? No, that seems like way too much work. The way I use alarm clocks, I set it as timers. Like, instead of saying, oh, wake me up at 8 p.m., wake me up in six hours from now. That's exactly how I'm gonna set up the alarm clock. I have this remote, there's a sensor display thing with this code. So let's say you wanna sleep for seven hours, times 60 minutes, 420 minutes, four, two, zero, enter, and it's gonna go down by one, every one minute. And once it reaches zero, it's gonna slap the shit out of you. Could you guys just imagine if I tried to bring this with me on an airplane? What do you think TSA would think if they saw this in my bag? Yeah. Servo fork. Here's what you get when you put it together. Alright, that's fucking creepy. I think I just discovered how electronic toothbrushes are made. <laughs> Welcome to the fucking hack house. This is such a fucking fire hazard. Believe it or not, there's actually a reason I put a fork on a servo motor. Uh, there's a sensor over here, and when someone walks by, it sends a signal to that Arduino, which then moves this fork. Oh, Nicholas, could you come in here? Hmm? <laughs> Dude, what was that? It was so weak. Yo, Nick, what's your favorite part about getting slapped by that thing? It's the most physical contact you've had this month. <laughs> Alright, he's gonna catch that cherry in his mouth. Let's see it. <laughs> Ow! Dude, what am I on? Alright, I'm done. So I just spent like over a hundred dollars on a soldering iron handed directly to a resident. Nobody fucking handed me a soldering iron. How do they just hand it to the wrong house and why would someone even take it? That's such a weird thing to steal. All right, fuck it. I just bought a new one. Sick. Dude, why? Do you think you're overreacting a bit? No. There's a fucking relay, dude. 
<laughs> you could see right through it. That's a little too fast, I'm not gonna lie to you. To slap someone? Bro, put knives on that shit. Oh my god. What are you eating? Some like veggies, and then got a banana. What is, what even is this? 